Welcome back to my YouTube channel for today's video. It's our day 3 of our Vlogmas 2023. And today, I am finally gonna show you where I am living. So, I am living here in an apartment in New York City with currently 3 roommates. So, we are total of 4 living in this apartment. Right now, I wanna show you how does my living situation is because I actually work full time for like 4 jobs. So... I know it doesn't kind of like make sense but I do work two jobs as a restaurant and two jobs as a hotel but thank god my boss and my managers actually work on my schedule so some of them I work in home some of them I work on the phone while working on a different job and some of them I need to physically be there but anyway I want to tell you why we're gonna be doing this whole cleanup because my mom actually messaged me it wasn't by my self decision i did not decide this to do it by myself my mom actually forced me to do it i have the issue of not cleaning my place or i wait for my mom to clean it i mean i do clean it broom here and there like wipe somewhere in here but i actually don't organize things like i just leave them the way it was so i can like remember where they were but my mom visited me and me like Oh my god, I'm tired of the man, but I'm not a bad I'm not a bad man, but I'm not a bad guy. Which is not true. I am not a bad And I put my stuff in the way I remember it. It wasn't because I just randomly put there. For example, oh, my comb is supposed to be in my vanity. Oh, now you need to put it in the drawer because you know you're not going to show that to people. Um, who's people, mom? Who is visiting me? Ah, oh, yeah, so much and so forth. So that's been going on for like a month now before I actually traveled to even to Guatemala. But your girl been working, traveling, working and traveling. So I never really have a time to clean up everything. And to be honest, I never actually even do my laundry for four months now. Even you guys saw me bought a laundry bag. That was meant for me to use it as a backpack, go to the laundry shop, and let the people do the laundry. But your girl is still lazy and never did that. We might not do that today, the laundry part, but I need to put the laundry in the laundry bag. So I'm going to make a list, which is just going to be in my head because I know what I'm going to do in my house. But I'll be showing you how messy is my living situation. And I know there is supposed to don't have any excuse, but... Where is the time I can clean this if I never been home, okay? I'm always working and if I'm not working, I need to sleep because you're gonna die if I don't have sleep because I cannot just keep sleeping in the subway every now and then. So, without further ado, I guess, mm, I don't wanna do this, <laughs> but let's get started. I don't want Papa. But let's do it. Okay, so this is how my place look like. I am actually not embarrassed that my place is successfully messy and dirty. <laughs> successfully means I have something that I <laughs> spend my money on working hard myself. And those are my laundry, I know. But I'm gonna figure out how can I clean this. I'm gonna show you a time lapse of everything. Here is my desktop, my bedroom, I mean my bed, my printer area, my vanity under my table. And we're gonna do some dishes because, you know, living with a roommate, we always have dishes in the sink. Even nobody is even eating here. Just keep stacking up dishes there. Which we are gonna stop doing that habit. Yeah, right, coming from me. Huh? <laughs> Ooh, I'm not ready for this. But, alright, let's do this right here right now yep i'm procrastinating that's why i'm gonna keep talking to you this is me way of talking to you guys so i won't do the work but eventually i need to do the work because we have some business to do and i have like work at like 9 p.m my boss and some of my meetings gonna head i only have an hour to clean but we're gonna be cleaning while we are in the phone once the meeting started Alright, it's just 
8.14 and my boss is already calling me. So, we need to answer his phone calls and I'm gonna be in my headphones freaking talking to all of them while trying to clean here. Because I need to pass some of employees' resume to him. So, we need to talk about all the employees getting hired. That's why I need to be in my phone while cleaning. See, this is what I was telling you. I cannot freaking work because I need... I mean, I cannot freaking clean because I need to work. And it's 8 p.m. at night, which I'm currently supposed to be working in my physical job. And I do the same thing over and over again. That's all I can do for now. So I didn't put that in the dish because I want to save that candle over there. So I'm just going to leave that there because we're going to do that for later. And that's all. All my lip gloss are over there. And then my skincare need to be in front of me. So I'll be doing it. And these are some of the books and notebooks that I'm going to be using. So that's why they're going to stay there. Because we're going to put some shelves right over there that is coming so we're gonna fix that afterwards but for now they will be there next we're gonna try to fix my setup because i'm actually sitting in a phone call right now but of course i mute myself because they're just talking blabbering and like talking about christmas that they just already spoke about to me for like 10 minutes now we are like having some issues for employees, but uh, I already solved that out. He's just like pain in the ass and doesn't want to listen to me. So I'm just going to keep listening to them until they figure out how to solve this. It's just so hard to be a girl in your job and then everybody's a man because they never listen to me at all. They think of me as a baby. So I mute myself and just going to keep recording here and there until they finally ask for my opinion which is gonna be the end maybe after an hour of phone call so let me clear my whole setup so we can you know have a nice setup before my mom will dangle my ass or beat the shit out of me because i never clean i'm gonna show her this video and be like huh your girl clean but that's all i can do okay oh you know what Let, let's remove that too that's like a leak in my apartment I need to call my landlord for that. Um, we're gonna try to remove that, but let's set up this. And also we're gonna be unboxing some stuffs that I just got, like the UPS come in and I picked it up downstairs. So we're gonna unbox those after we clean our whole desktop mess, like, ew. It's 8.56, I'm done with my meeting. I kind of solved some financial issues that we are trying to build. But anyway, done with my job. Finally, get the time to watch my movie and start cleaning. And I think we're almost done. It's so cool that, I didn't know it, was, it wasn't hard to clean my room. I thought it was just like, oh. Or maybe because I'm recording, that's why it's easy for me to clean. But look, isn't that cute? A pink line. You know, my favorite color is yellow. But yellow room make me so depressed. I feel like pink or purple make me like, oh damn, I'm living in the new world where there's a color pink line. So yeah, we're almost done cleaning. It's mostly just blooming and wiping things. I think we're gonna unbox some stops that came and we're gonna wash some of the dishes and clean the kitchen. And that's all because I already like cleaned the bathroom like two days ago. So the bathroom is clean and then stuck with my skincare. So I'm not gonna show you guys that. But are we gonna do the kitchen because there is also something that came but it's missing some of the parts. But let's unbox it so I can show you what we got because your girl wanna feel like home here in our apartment so i add some stuffs for our place that we can use hello and we are done cleaning my bedroom and i was about to do my kitchen but adriano 
my roommate is cooking. So, I'm gonna let him finish cooking before we clean that up. So, we're gonna head on and unbox our pretty and my most favorite thing that's gonna be added to my desk, which is my Canon Printer G620. I already have this a long time ago, but sadly, somebody stole it in my old apartment. So, we're gonna buy a new one, which it finally arrived, and we're gonna be unboxing it and show you what I'm gonna be doing with this kind of printer. I actually have some products that I print long time ago with the same printer and turns out to be the boxes of my lip gloss. I'm gonna show you one. This one, you see? Sophia Beauty, but I actually make a new design that... So I created this actually and I cut it myself. I printed out and cut it myself. So. So let's unbox this right now. Ta da! Let me show you. Yeah, this wasn't heavy. Now it's heavy. That's how it looks like. I have so many wires of this now. So it comes with a wire. And it comes with a variety of inks. So I have the yellow one, red, blue red again black gray so the cool thing about this canon is it's a photo printer which is gonna make all my boxes look more realistic than just having a black color so gray actually add more color to the picture because I think because there's no white that's why the gray would works well I don't know it was just like showing it on YouTube how the result of the picture is Oh, look! My printer is back. This expensive ass printer is finally here. I'm gonna set up my printer with you guys as well. Alright, now it's time to set the printer up. And we're gonna do that quickly because I kind of like know how to set this up already. I guess so. I don't remember. That was like two years ago. So my printer is already all set up and it's just aligning everything with the ink and whatever is going inside that printer. So I load two papers because they are gonna test the ink out there after he finished going on with his system maintenance. So after that there's like one more we're gonna unbox but let's eat first because Adriana cooked me some food that I'm gonna show you what it is because he always be cooking good food out here. Thank you! Good night! We're just about to eat our burger made by Adrian. His name is Adrian, not Adriano. I'm the only one who calls him Adriano. But of course, while we eating, we need to finish some of the work because my boss gave me some deadline right now. So. Let's eat and work a little bit before we head on and unbox one more thing and then reset and clean the whole kitchen. Oh my god, the kitchen. I'm gonna stress out about that because it's so messy. This burger is always just so tasty that you're just gonna fall in love when you're in a relationship with him but i'm not so whoever gonna be with him you're gonna be the luckiest girl ever when it comes to your belly because his food is always fire just so. finished eating and we are about to clean our messiest kitchen ever there's like a lot of dishes that i need to do so i'm about to do it and do the stove and do the I might not do the refrigerator because I need to have everybody here so we can remove stuff that we don't eat. 
but we're gonna clean the dishes. Alright, so next we're gonna be putting away some groceries. So we're gonna start with all the eggs, which I'm gonna put here because we have 60 pieces of egg because I need to eat egg two times a day. So we're gonna put all our eggs in here. Alright, we just finished putting the eggs away and we finally set up the printer and it's printing a photo right now. Which is just me, but I'm trying to see if it's working and I just printed out Why did I print, print it in a letter paper? I wish I just used a photo paper But look how it is! It's coming out nice! It's not that bad Yeah, that's me. I was in the gym earlier So I just want to see if it's working Ta-da! Alright, so lastly, we have some of our groceries, which I'm going to show you what I got. We have some eggplant, red onions, because red onions is actually more healthier than white onions. Okra, spinach, carrot, red potato. Honestly, I don't know if, if this is a sweet potato or red potato. I don't know which one is the kamote, but it said red potato is more healthier. So I bought that one again. Tomatoes because your girl loves tomato and onion for her soup. So the recipe is mostly for the sinigang because we're gonna make some salmon sinigang and I'm gonna like try to fix that in my refrigerator but if it don't fit we're gonna leave it outside since it's the cold season anyway. Hopefully the birds won't eat it. Um, Lastly the one I keep telling you that I'm gonna be unboxing it's a brand new TV. The problem is, I told you I'm missing the part, so if I open it, it's gonna be in the floor and I don't want that to happen because now people are gonna be kicking it. I'm gonna be kicking it as well. But I'm gonna show you how my TV looks like. It's right over there and that was the, actually the last thing we're gonna do where we're gonna unbox it. But the problem is I don't have the TV mount, but we're gonna stick it here in the wall. So we're just gonna leave it there for now so it won't break down. So that's all we have. We finally <laughs> cleaned everything and I'm so happy that I did this because I finally have a nice brand new life again that I can start over to mess it again like what my mom would say. Oh, you're just gonna mess that up in like two days. Cause I like message her and then she just like bullied me for like I'm gonna be messing. She didn't even congratulate me. This is the problem about my mom. She never say sorry or congratulate me. But anyway, that's gonna be for tonight. And thank you for watching my day three vlogmas. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and share my video to spread happiness in the world. Bye, babies, and thank you for watching. We have more vlogmas coming soon. Bye. Mwah.